in a battle between links. Which shall win? TP. What's up, everybody, and thanks for returning back to Jack and the Xbox. Today, I want to talk about two different links. Those are the wrong links. There we go. Those are the right ones. So I want to talk about two different routers. Uh, I took the time and ordered a Dynalink uh, router because I've heard great things about it. I've seen a couple other YouTubers talk about them as well as some of the comments you guys have left. Uh, and the reason why I wanted to try it out is because it had a specific feature that I've heard uh, actually improves your ping. And that's been my one qualm with T-Mobile Internet from the beginning, is that the ping is not that great. And when you're a gamer like me and you like to stream every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday, selfless plug, then you, what you want is good ping because when you get into those firefights and first-person shooters, the quicker you're able to react, the better. So ping's a big deal, and being able to change the MTU uh, is something that is very important to drop that ping for T-Mobile Internet because it's a mobile internet provider uh, as opposed to something like uh, your, your typical internet providers. Uh, and the reason why is they usually uh, broadcast at 1500 MTU, whereas uh, things like AT&T, T-Mobile, Sprint, uh, Verizon, all of those guys actually have a lower MTU because of the type of internet it is. And for T-Mobile, it's 1420 is what it broadcasts at, uh, it, as far as your ping goes. So I went ahead and I ordered this Dynalink right here. I was super excited about this. I even, I, I was going to do a whole unboxing video. It was really excited because I thought this was my new router after seeing a lot of the videos from everybody else. And uh, I plugged it in and fired it up. And here are the speeds that I got. Okay, guys, let me first apologize for the audio. My microphone's not cooperating right now. But look at the ping. It's about five or six less than what it had been with my TP link, but my download speeds are terrible. Usually I'm getting at least 150 to 250 with my TP link. And even my upload speeds are pretty low too. I mean, I'm getting into really close to the 20s. I get up to the 20s right there, but much slower than the TP link. And you might ask yourself, what about all the settings, Jack, in the Xbox? Did you fix all those? Yes, I went through everything. I tried every single setting I could in order to maximize them. And these are the best speeds for some reason that I could get out of the Dynalink. All right, guys, now it's time for the TP-Link speed test. You can see 56 on the ping, which is a little bit higher, not too terrible. But look at the download speeds. I mean, 200 megabits per second faster. I mean, it's fantastic. That's way better than the Dynalink. And then we get to the upload speeds, and there you have it. Uh, it much better there, too. So two out of the three are better with the TP-Link. I know I've been talking about ping, but that's not enough of a difference to get me to move from the TP-Link to the Dynalink. Now I've got links to both of the routers that I tested uh, in the description below. If you're interested in looking at either of those for purchase, go ahead and click on those and it'll take you to Amazon. Well, there you have it guys. After all of the comparison, survey says that the Dynalink is not the router for me. It didn't drop my pings. Uh, or my ping. It also didn't uh, do anything special for my speeds. It actually slowed them down. So all said and done, I will not be switching to the Dynalink router. I will stick with my TP-Link for now. But the hunt is still on. I am looking for the right router for me that will drop those pings. The next router I'm planning on trying is the Asus. For great things about that, it is a gaming router. And so I'm going to test it out with the T-Mobile internet, and I will share that with you. Now, if you have a router that you're using right now that is dropping your ping uh, and also maintaining those high speeds, uh, please leave that in the comments. I'd love to know what you're using. 
as well as see if it works for me and then do another comparison video and show that to, to the rest of the community. Uh, also, if you have any questions or comments, please leave those. I've enjoyed interacting with each of you through those, so by all means, I'm loving it. Uh, last thing is I do stream every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Uh, video games. I like to play a lot of Halo. I like to play video games with my kids. I like to stream those. So please, super smash that like and subscribe button and join the community. We love you guys, and we'll catch you on the next one.